Hello everybody and welcome to week seven of our Vine Tots get together. So let's sing, shall we? Clap your knees. Let's sing hello together. Let's sing hello together. Let's sing hello together. We're glad you came today. Right, our next story is still from Genesis and it's called The Sneaky Snake. So we talked about the first man and the first woman last time and they were really happy. Really, really happy in the garden. And God said to them, eat any fruit from this beautiful garden. So, oh, a lovely apple. Oh, beautiful apple. Except the fruit from that one tree there in the middle. Not that one. Okay. But one day a snake crept up to the woman and told her a lie. We don't like lies, do we? And this snake, here he comes, he said to the woman, there's nothing wrong with eating fruit from that tree. Nothing wrong at all. And what happened next was very sad. Do we really feel as though we want to cry now? The man and the woman disobeyed God and they ate the fruit. Oh no. So they had to leave the beautiful garden. Bye bye. Bye bye. Hello, and now it's time to do our craft. And what do you think we should make today? I've made a puppet and he's asleep at the moment until I put my hand in. So when I put my hand in, he wakes up. Can you see I put some eyes on him? You could put, you could draw your eyes if you want and you could put a nose and there's his rosy cheeks. If I pull him right down there, can you see? And now he can talk. There you are, you see? And I wonder what he's going to say to us today. Oh, and I've got a pipe cleaner for his hair, but I can't put his hair on yet. But let's see if he wants to say something to us. Oh, he does. Oh, he said he didn't like Val's story today. No, it was very sad, wasn't it? Very sad. He didn't like the sneaky snake. And he tricked it. The man and the woman, didn't he? And they disobeyed God. Oh dear. And I don't like that's the end of the story. Oh, it's not the end of the story. It's not the end of the story. He said God's got a plan. God had a plan. And some people know, and some people don't know. Are you going to tell us God's plan then? Not today. Oh, why not? You've got to wait. Okay, then we will put your hair on your head. Now, so I've pulled that up there, and here's the pipe cleaner. I wonder what is. Well, I don't think we want his hair to stick up like that, do we? Let's see if we can twist it round there, and twist it round there. Oh, let's see if I can curl it round my finger, shall I? turn him round there and turn you round there and now we'll have a look and see what you look like. Are you ready? Here we go. Takes a little while. You could, if you've got an old sock at home or mummy or daddy or a grown up and there we are and now can you see who do you think he looks like now? Ooh. Oh! Goodness me! He reminds me of Rudolph. Does he you? He said yes, but he hasn't got a shiny nose. Shall we see if we can find a shiny nose for him? Oh, just look at that. Do you think he looks... What do you think he looks like now? Are you pleased? Yes, he's pleased. Oh, and he's got something else to say. Really? He said, Rudolph comes at Christmas with Santa. 
and Christmas story is part, it's the start of God's plan. Wow, that's good. So we'll say bye-bye, and will you come and see us another week? Yes, you will. So he says, bye, see you later, bye. And hello, hello. And we've now come to our song time. And I have a new special helper uh, who's gonna be here for the next few weeks. So would you like to tell everybody your name? in a really loud voice. Can you tell everybody your name at home? Millie. It's Millie! She can clap for Millie, because she's going to help us out this week and for the next two weeks. So Millie, would you like to choose our first song? Can you see what you can find down there and show everybody at home? Do you think you can, please? <gasps> oh, we're going to go for that one first. Can you hold it up so everybody can see at home? All the way, that's it. Well done. Should we go a little bit closer? Oh, there we go. What is it, Millie? Oh. It's an apple. And what we thought we could sing today is um, maybe some of you at home have heard of the song Five Green Bottles, um, but we thought we'd do a variation of five green apples hanging on a tree. Do you think we can do that? Should we give it a go? Hopefully you'll be able to help us um, at home if you've heard of this one before. So if we can hold up, shall we hold up, um, I'll do that hand, five fingers. There we go, good job. And we'll sing Five Green Apples. Are you ready? Here goes. Five green apples hanging on a tree. Five green apples hanging on a tree. And if one green apple should accidentally fall, how many would there be? Is that how many? Four. Four. There'd be four green apples hanging on a tree. Four green apples hanging on a tree. Four green apples hanging on a tree And if one green apple should accidentally fall That's going to be tricky, isn't it? Which three should we have? Those fingers? Good job! There'd be three green apples hanging on a tree Should we start again? <gasps> Need lots of puff. Ready? Three green apples hanging on a tree Three green apples hanging on a tree and if one green apple should accidentally fall, there'd be two green apples hanging on the tree. Can we do it all over again? Should we try? Two green apples hanging on a tree. Two green apples hanging on a tree. And if one green apple should accidentally fall, should we, should we pick our apple up again? Here goes. There'd be one green apple hanging on a tree. Last time. One green apple hanging on a tree. One green apple hanging on a tree. And if one green apple should accidentally fall. How many's left? There'd be no green apples hanging on a tree. Yay, should we give a clap? Clap for ourselves, clap for you at home, well done. And have we got one more song today, Millie? What's it gonna be? Can you show everybody at home? What's it gonna be? Can you show everybody? And what are we gonna sing? Bunny. Bunnies, and what song can we sing with the bunny? Um, sleeping bunnies. Is it time to go to sleep? Yes, is it time to go to sleep? Can you go to sleep at home? Now, we're going to stay sitting and standing, aren't we? So you can still see us at home. I'll go that way. But at home, the children can lay down on the floor, can't they? Or the sofa, or their beds, or anywhere. So here goes. Can you go to sleep, everybody? Are you ready? Can you close your eyes? <gasps> can you close your eyes? Oh, I'll close mine too. Here goes. Ready? See the little bunny sleeping till it's nearly noon. Shall we try and wake them with a merry tune? Oh, so still are they ill? Wake up soon. Not yet, not yet, not yet. Shh, 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 shh. I wonder if anybody's waking. Are you ready? Here goes. Wake up, little bodies, wake up! Now how high can you jump? How high can you jump? Ready? Hop little bunnies, hop, hop, hop. Hop little bunnies, hop, hop, hop. Hop little bunnies, hop, hop, hop. Hop, hop little bunnies, hop and stop. Yay, nice big clap. Yay, I'm just to say bye, say bye, bye. <laughs> right, here.
here we go. This is the end of another session. So let's tap our knees, shall we? Here we go. Let's sing goodbye together. Let's sing goodbye together. Let's sing goodbye together. We're glad you came today.